Welcome, Scorpio. Thank you for tuning in to your horoscope for August 7, 2023, on your channel, Zodiac Attraction. Discover what the future holds for you in terms of finances, lucky numbers, love, health, work, family, compatibility, and favorite color. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on daily updates. Get ready to explore your destiny. Let's get started. Maintaining an identity outside your relationships will feel particularly important this morning, dear Scorpio, as the Taurus moon aligns with Saturn. These vibes pair well with healthy boundaries that allow you to explore personal interests while still maintaining close connections with the people you adore. If there are any classes you've been thinking of taking, now may be a good time to invest in nurturing new hobbies or creative skills. Good vibes float tonight when Luna blows a kiss to Mercury, putting you in the mood for community on a grand scale, making it a good time to socialize online. Your power of concentration and perception are at their peak now and this makes you extra sensitive to the people around you and their plight. This will help you to mend any past breach. You may come in contact with someone from whom you are estranged. This is a good time to make up the differences, even if it involves a few awkward moments. It's not that you want to spend your Monday at work or organizing your home office, it's just that if you don't take care of some urgent matter, your work week will feel like a pressure cooker. With proud Leo Sun orbiting your career 10th house and fist bumping impulsive Taurus Moon in your systematic 7th house, you could accomplish in just an hour or two what would take the better part of a business day. If you've made any social commitments, let them encourage you to hyperfocus, a Scorpio specialty, and quit when you say you will. On the plus side, you can turn any chaos into neat and organized fashion and start your night off with a win to celebrate. Sunday's Sun Jupiter Square asks, do people see you for the capable powerhouse that you are? As your aesthetically oriented label knows, images tell an important part of the story. If your style is edgier than corporate, level it up from the basic button down, or at least accessorize with style. And practice walking into the room as if it were your own. Smile, make eye contact, and pretend you're hosting the party. It's not about selfishness, Scorpio, you're just making it easier for people to see how interesting you really are. You're in the beginning stages of a whole new phase of your astrological cycle, Ever since the primal sun entered your 10th house of professional honors and long-term ambitions, you've had your attention focused on working your way up life's great ladder. If you haven't yet felt this energy permeating your life, don't worry, sometimes it can take a little while for us to feel the full effects of the sun moving through our chart. Today, however, work matters will be blessed regardless thanks to an incredibly positive angle between the sun in your career sector and the moon in your daily work sector. La Luna is currently moving through your seventh house of routine and wellness, giving you the urge to clean up your act in the short term and the long term. These two planets will form what's known as a trine throughout the day, blending their energy, so get to work, because you can make some serious progress right now. Today's transits bring an interactive theme into your life, dear Scorpio. The moon moves into your partnership sector, and you're more inclined to seek feedback or input. A Mercury-Mars parallel enhances this theme further. With this energy in play, you will likely find yourself quite busy and engaged. You are interested in sharing, learning, and applying what you learn. You might err on the side of taking on too much. As such, it's best to avoid information overload, but pay special attention to emerging ideas. For best results, be quick but not hasty. In fact, it's a good time to believe in yourself, your ideas, and your work. You might take the lead in a group or with friends or associates. You can be particularly motivated to resolve a problem, particularly friendship or people-related. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and Luck Listen to your intuition, Scorpio. As a water sign, you can be incredibly empathetic to everyone and things around you. These intuitive feelings may be heightened in a grounded manner when the moon becomes exalted in your opposite zodiac sign, Taurus. 
pay attention to what arises when considering your professional contracts, commitments, and partnerships. Since the moon will sextal Saturn retrograde in Pisces, it could even be a fantastic time to reconsider how you prioritize your creative ventures. Do not be afraid to rework your arrangements. You can make changes to your environment which will greatly assist the transformations you are experiencing right now. What changes can you make on a personal level to make things a bit easier on yourself? This is a good question to focus on today as much can be achieved under this energy. This is a productive time and you have the power to transform your circumstances. Meditation with the crystal clear quartz is highly recommended and can help you reflect on your current financial situation in a way that is more detached on an emotional level. Keep one by your side if possible. Good things are on the way. Lucky numbers. Your lucky numbers for August 7th are 11, 45, 33, 26, 8, 16. Daily love. As much as you crave constant change, motion, and evolution for yourself, Scorpio, you don't quite like to experience that in a partnership. With the Great Awakener spinning across the sky from you in your solar seventh house of relationships since 2018, you've seen some big ups and downs. On the one hand, singles have likely been attracting unique, eccentric, or even visionary people into their life who also possess long-term potential. Couples may have noticed how their significant other is demanding more freedom and exploration and has been acting far more erratic than ever before. Are you willing to do the daily work necessary in order for your romantic partnerships to work out? This is a great question to meditate on today as the moon is in Taurus and in your seventh house. Relationships just like any other aspect of our lives require hard work, discipline and devoting ourselves to them in a consistent way on a daily basis. It is the little things that we do every day that create our larger reality. Check in and see if there are certain aspects of your relationship that could afford you putting more effort and energy into them. Maybe it would be helpful for you and your lover to create a daily ritual that you commit to, this allows you to have a time of the day that is completely dedicated to you just being with one another. Having such a practice allows you to experience more closeness and intimacy as it provides a safe space for you to relate and be with one another. At work. You may be trying to communicate smoothly, but few people will not let you and a dramatic scene may arise at the workplace due to their interference. Your viewpoint will be regarded against the benefit of organization. So better take a back seat and let others get backfired. Focus on your personal development in the meanwhile. Discipline is discipleship, this means that discipline isn't thinking, oh, I hate doing this but I have to do it anyway. It means knowing that you're doing what you're doing because it is paving the way for you to accomplish what you want to. It is about being a disciple, a student in service of whatever cause you're devoting yourself to, even if it's solely a personal one. The moon is in Taurus and in your seventh house of daily routine and work and this is a topic to deeply contemplate on. It is the things that we do every day that create our overall reality and determine whether we can achieve what we want to or not. Health. Minor illnesses are on the cards today. You may feel a slight cold or a headache coming on. This is just a passing phase, but it may leave you feeling somewhat weak. So, do not schedule too many appointments today. Plenty of rest and relaxation will take care of the problem and you will soon be fit and fine. You may feel more positive and uplifted than usual today, Scorpio, making it easier for you to lift others up. Being there for someone will fulfill your need to be of service to others today. Try checking on a friend or family member to see how you can help them emotionally. Amber is considered good luck in relationships and romantic love. Place a piece of amber near you and your partner when talking through things to keep the energy calm and loving. Greek yogurt contains probiotics, which are good bacteria that increase gut health. For breakfast, try topping a bowl of Greek yogurt with berries and granola today. Family and friends. The day is perfect for love. Show your appreciation for that special someone in your life by doing something unexpected and see the day become special. Romance is in the air. If you are single, 
Today is the day when you may meet the love of your life or just begin to see a close person in a completely new and romantic light. You are going to be very, very busy today. And while it would be lovely to tell you that includes some wonderful romantic roles in the hay, that's not exactly where the stars are pointing so you might as well roll up your sleeves and get to work before you worry about taking off your top altogether. The primal sun recently entered your 10th house of professional goals and ambitions, and while he's here he is going to be focusing your attention on work for the most part. While that doesn't mean you won't get any at all during this time, it does mean your attention is going to be largely occupied with work. Compatibility At Work Leo In Love Geminis In Luck Cancer Your lucky color today Light Blue We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.